Hello everyone. I'll first introduce myself. Um, I'm Gaita Farida, and uh, I'm from Uganda. And I'm here to talk about one major thing, and that's homophobia in Uganda, in my home country, in my motherland. Okay. Ah. Uh, them, there are few people in Uganda that are gay, but they do exist. But people there in Uganda are really, really homophobic. 90% of the population in Uganda, 90% of the population in Uganda are homophobic. 5% don't care at all. They don't care. And maybe 4% care. Care and within those who care, you can find those who are like, for me I have no problem with that. I don't care. You know, for me, I have a little sympathy for those gay, just like me. I'm not gay. I'm not a lesbian. But it does not mean that I'm going to judge someone out there who is gay. <laughs> as well as I don't want to be judged. You know? Mom! Yes, many people out there, many people out there in Uganda are homophobic, they're homophobic, and they hate gay people. For what? For what? Just for one good reason that they talk about the Bible. They talk about their Bible. How much do you know that Bible? How much do you know God? If you really understand God well, you should not judge. You should not stand in God's shoes. Whereby you don't know even where, where the God wears shoes. Then why should you put yourself in the position of God and judge someone else? People, we should use brains when we are doing stuff. You're standing back asking that person, why are you lesbian? Why are you gay? She's not going to give you any reasonable answer because she does not know either. She does not know. She's, she's just there, just like the way she knows that, oh gosh, I'm living, I'm having life, you know, I'm not dead. And she knows that she's gay. As well as you also know that you're there and you're straight. If I stand back and I ask you the same, why are you straight? You're not going to tell me any reasonable answer that I'm straight because of this. That is bullshit. You're going to come around by saying I'm, uh, I'm straight because God wants me to be straight. Yeah, God wants you to be straight. God wants her to be lesbian. Then jo don't judge her. You don't stand a position to judge another. But many people there are making other people's lives miserable. Miserable, miserable just because of their sex orientation, which bothers me a lot. A lot. I'm not free with that with those behaviors. No. And that's why I've sat here and talk and say, let me talk about this. You know, I'm not good very very deep into that. I'm just going to give you a little source of it. A little. 
top layer. That is not right. <laughs> Look, um, not a lesbian as I said, but I can't tell you that I think I know what those people are going through right now because I'm one person who always stands back and look at certain situations and try to put myself there I say what if I was me just just picture that and say to yourself what if it was me and it was her the one I'm doing this to doing that to me how would I have felt many people are losing lives just because of you we are, we are losing children people are killing themselves people are being killed because you you know homophobia is the best thing in your life judging is the best thing you should do but you're judging her but remember you also be judged one day you will be definitely judged you think you know more about the Bible no you think you know more about the Bible but you know nothing because if only you knew the Bible very well, you shouldn't have judged that person. You know, God, you can never be God and you never be God. People are moving under fear. People are suffering. You come out that you're gay. You're tortured. You're threatened. They look at you from A to Z. How you sleep, how you go to the toilet, how you eat, how you do everything. Can someone get a normal life? You stand back and say you want to put a smile on an African child. That but put a smile on her. Don't judge her. Treat her like a human being because she's one. You know? Those who judge, can you even tell me the reason as to why you're named after your name? Now oh, you're going to say for me I took my grandfather's name. I, I was called uh, Saint Pata uh, Saint Pata uh, Martin Martin Saint Pata. Can you give me a reason, a, a real good reason as to why you're born by your mother, by your father, born with your sisters? You make me oh, people. <laughs> I'm sorry. It looks like I'm as if I'm, I'm quarreling here, but this is sick. This is definitely sick. I mean. It has no proper definition for what people are doing to others to be uh, for them to judge them like that. This is crazy. I don't know. Um, you know, they talk about. Uh, which I'm, which I'm also going to talk about right now. They talk about uh, that the father, uh, gay people recruit uh, school children into homo uh, into homosexuality. Really? Oh come on! They recruit those who want to be recruited. No one is going to get pregnant because his mother told her to go get pregnant. Of course, you did what? 
Everyone's going to 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 to, to be a uh, uh, a bitch. Oh, I'm sorry to use that word. I'm I'm really sorry, but no one is going to stand alongside the rod for money because her friend told her you want you want the money and you want to stand there and you want other things you know so don't talk about that our children are being uh, are being uh, recruited into homosexuality how many how many and it was so stupid for that guy who brought out a kid and say this young girl was recruited and was given a laptop i'm not going to talk about names i'm not going to talk about people you know but when i talk about this those who know will know and even that young girl would have been so ashamed of herself to come out like that and say blah 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 that is stupid really you wanted Watch even I don't think that that's real. People don't be so corrupt to reach an extent of being just stupid, just to, to make other people look bad in front of the public eye. <laughs> it's a shared video. Ah. Uh, if you get uh, comment about it if you if you like it i'll post other uh, videos on youtube and uh i'm not only going to talk about uh gay life in uganda but i'll have to talk about other stuff um if you like it post your comments right there down ciao baby I love ya. <laughs> uh.